Hey guys, it's Donnie here again. This time I'm gonna focus on a very near and dear place to me. Literally, it's right by my house. It's called Alas Meat Market. My pal George runs the shop, so we're gonna pay George a visit. Okay, I know you as George, but tell the millions watching this right now who you are and what you do. So my name is uh, George Zodanis. <laughs> I'm a butcher. I've been a butcher since I was 13 years old. 13. 13. Okay. And uh, I talk a lot. <laughs> <laughs> is butcher the right term? That's what I like to be called because that's what I do. I butcher meat. So, you know, you can be a little more politically correct, but right. you know, you're George. Well, I'm George. I'm with you on this one. Exactly. When you cut, what you suggest, is it better to like go at it slow and just sort of serrate it, pull it that? Or is it better like lumberjack, old school, bang? No, slow and, and clean. Really? Yeah. Clean cuts because you don't want to make the piece of meat that you're cutting look like a little. But I, I think like puzzle. fewer chops. Like if I'm hammering a nail in, it's a lot easier. Like it's, it looks better too, by the way. You just go one shot, right? It looks cool, but it depends what we're doing. Are we cutting bones or are we cutting we're just cutting meat? bones? Because like, look, if we're cutting a veal shoulder, for example, you're gonna do one quick, nice okay. movement, break it so you don't get that. Yeah. If you're cutting meat, you're gonna bounce off it. It's gonna look nasty. I love marketing. You obviously you know this. Yes. But I gotta say, I'm learning from the, the pro here. I'll, I'll tell you why. Your marketing is genius for its efficiency. He has lollipops behind the counter. <laughs> My kids can't walk by your butcher shop without wanting to come in here. It costs me money. Yes. Because they want a lollipop. It's really amazing. Yeah. Get to the kids and the parents will come. Uh, Georgie, what is your favorite cut of meat? My favorite cut of meat would have to be a prime rib or a ribeye ste steak. Yeah, 100%. Okay. Dead or alive, yes. what is your favorite kind of animal? Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, I go back and forth from lamb and, and beef. Alive or dead? Dead. <laughs> dead. Alive would be a shark. Shark. Yes. Is it okay to eat pork that's still a little bit pink? Yes. It is? Yes. Back in the old days, what they were feeding them and the way they were raised, they carried a lot of bacteria, so it had to be cooked well done. Okay. Now, the way animals are being raised and treated, pork could be a little pink. I'm not talking about rare. Okay. But a little pink is good. Okay. We have a lot of common. Yes, we're both Greek. You're welcome, world. We both have luscious blue eyes. I don't know if you can see that. We both have daughters. Yes. And we both have something to do connected with cows. You chop up cows, mm -hmm. and I am the guy who finds cash cows in my business. <laughs> <laughs> so I want you to know there's a lot more in common than just, just the lovely blue eyes. You know, I didn't know that. So now we're, we're now you more know. related. We're almost brothers in this point. Exactly. Morning. Sorry, I got lost in his eyes there. <laughs> okay, George, we're gonna do a thing called the Mangoes Minute. I'm gonna tell you a bunch of words, and I want you to say the first thing that pops into your mind when I fire off a word. Raptors or maple leaves? Maple leaves. I sent you to a game once. I know. Babies or puppies? Babies. Sandals and socks as a combo. How do you feel about that? Horrible. Would Horrible. you serve a customer that came in here with sandals and socks? Cash out, yes. Okay. <laughs> so not that bad. Theater or Netflix and chill? Netflix and chill. Uh -huh. Boat or plane? Plane. What is your favorite movie? Goodfellas. See, he was thinking of something way <laughs> more childish. Funny how. And he stopped. Anyway. Come clown me. <laughs> East or West? East. East. One thing that you're passionate about besides me. My child. Okay. Acapella or instrumental? Acapella. All right, yeah. very fast now. When I say a word, you're gonna repeat the word back to me. Pulp. Fiction. Beard. Yuppie. G. George. Sweet. Sugar. Doggy. Style. <laughs> French. Beret. Paper. Uh, pass. Bench. Warmer. Human. Centerpiece. Line. Dancing. Thank you, George. Thank you. Best of luck, bro. Thank you, brother. <laughs>